Days after being shown the door at Punt Road, Kevin Bartlett today walked straight back through it. Bartlett was again part of the Richmond faithful, celebrating the club's rich heritage. But the Tiger hero did notice just a few changes. He first arrived at Punt Road Oval as a 14-year-old begging for a game. 403 games, five premierships and a full head of hair later, Kevin Bartlett is back. This was the first time in 16 years that Bartlett has been seen at his spiritual home, not since the day he was sacked as coach. Today, there was no animosity. Bartlett joking with the man who was president at the time of his axing, Neville Crow. But that's history, and it's history which brought him back. Thank you very much for inviting me to uh, launch the book. Uh, they forget you very quickly down here at Tigerland. <laughs> This is the first time I've been back for 16 years and I can tell you it's very nice to come home. But when I drove in today, my parking spot was gone. <laughs> Bartlett was launching a chronicle of the Richmond Football Club compiled by his son, Rhett. So much a part of the club's history in his own right, this day was long overdue. A chance for Bartlett to catch up with mates and reflect on the good old days. Behind me was the old kitchen here where Peter Cameron and Charlie Priestley, a great player for the Tigers, used to cook the sausages and the eggs and the bacon before we'd walk across to the MCG and win a premiership. <laughs> While the glory days are long gone, a part of them has at least returned. The prodigal son has finally come home.